Go down. But it is the first time that uh, you, you find a candidate of the people challenging the incumbent anointed by the establishment. So this is a historic day in every sense of the word. My feeling today is, uh, is uh, very happy. I come here to in protest of the small circle selection. I demand the SL government to return the power to the people. No, I will boycott this farcical election. It's not an election. We are out here protesting. We want democracy as soon as possible. The number of votes cast for candidate number one, Mr. Alan Leung Ka Kit, is 123. The number of votes cast for candidate number two, Mr. Donald Zhang Yam Kun, is 649. That candidate number two, Mr. Donald Zhang Yam Kun, is elected at the election to Mr. Zhang. Of the total number of valid votes, I hereby declare... Can you pass the microphone, please? I'm honored to stand before you today as the re-elected chief executive of the Hong Kong Special Administrative Region. This is a solemn moment, solemn moment for me to extend to all of you my deep gratitude for the trust and faith you have given me. The maturity of the Hong Kong people have demonstrated throughout the electoral process. This has made this election very special and it laid out a solid foundation for moving towards universal suffrage. Will the next chief executive be elected by the people? They will certainly be elected by the people of Hong Kong. <laughs> In the past few months, we have seen a fundamental change of culture and a shift in values and expectation for politics. There is no turning back from here. Hong Kong people's determination to achieve universal suffrage in 2012 remains as strong as ever.